The Chinese military has moved a Long March 7 rocket to the final launch site. It's one of China's latest generation rockets, and it's expected to blast off in the next few days. CCTV's Wu Lei reports from the launch site in Hainan province. Moving to the final phase of its preparation, the Long March 7 carrier rocket is now in the process of vertical transportation. Since the rocket arrived here in the middle of May, staff members have been assembling parts and conducting tests. In the next few days, we will continue the final check on the whole system to guarantee each channel runs well. During the launching process, we will also monitor all the environmental data to provide a reference for future rockets. Wenchang Satellite Launch Center is the newest and the only coastal launch center in China. After finishing construction in 2014, the Long March 7 carrier rocket launch will be its first mission. The Long March 7 rocket and its payload is now carried on a mobile launch platform where it will be moved from the assembly building to the launch pad. They are 2,800 meters away from each other and may not seem so far apart. But moving a multi-ton rocket on the rail track is never an easy task. The entire moving process took about three hours. When the launch vehicle arrives at the launch pad, rotating platforms on the two sides of the tower are swung around it to allow for fueling and final checks. Today's vertical transportation went very well. In the next few days, we will enter the final fueling and launching process according to the weather conditions. The rocket uses liquid propellant, which makes it more environmentally friendly than previous modules. The Long March 7 is expected to be launched at an appropriate time between June the 25th and June the 29th. It will transport cargo for China's planned space station and is expected to become the main carrier for future space launches. Wu Lei, CCTV at Wenchang Satellite Launch Center.